Hey, what's going on guys? This is Danny for Dude Tech and welcome back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking a little bit more about the jailbreak status and a lot of things has been happening from a few days ago. So I've been watching a lot of details information. I already tweet that talking with the most of the stuff that I see already on Twitter. So let's go ahead and talking about most of the stuff that we saw already and most of the things that we uh, need to know about the jailbreak status. So first of all, I'm going to be jump and talking about about which from where right now or which version of uh, iOS right now it's available and which one is not is going to be available for the jailbreak in the near future so first of all as you guys can see here that we have the both uh, firmwares available right now which is going to be start from 11.2 up to 11.2.1 for those so uh, hard luck in the near future if that's going to be a get jailbreak so for those who already update to ios 11 starting from ios 11 up to ios 11.1.2 all those supposed to be with the new jailbreak with the uh, last information that we see already all those was is going to be supported Support the new uh, iOS 11 jailbreak in the near future and I'm gonna be talking uh, about that a little bit closer so uh, if we are talking about the iOS uh, 11 jailbreak status uh, most of the things right now has been done that is a lot of information about most of the people who works on the jailbreak for the iOS 11 they do a really pretty good job most of the things right now has been finished and we we can see or we can tell that the project it's almost done most the uh the developers on the jello break they post that on a twitter as you guys can see jonathan he's one of the people or one of the developers who work with the other stuff that they work on the ios 11 jello break project he's already talking about the jello break tool successfully so most of the things right now has been reached the last steps and we can say the 64-bit devices who actually support that that jailbreak the iPhone 6 the iPhone 7 the iPhone 8 and also it's confirmed is gonna be uh, the iPhone 10 or the iPhone X it will be work with that new jailbreak which is gonna be beautiful so uh, as you guys can see here Jonathan even talking about that as I told you guys and in most of the things has been already done so I believed that we're gonna be see the jello break maybe before the end of the year I hope that and then all we're waiting for right now to update Cydia so Cydia has has to be updated before they releasing the jello break or maybe the developers and I don't know yet who's the person who's gonna be in charge about who's gonna be uh, release that jello break in the public but uh, we still waiting right now to confirm talking about Cydia he already talking about most of the money that he lose every year about Cydia so if you want to visit his website I will be put that link in the description if you want to just throw for him a couple bucks that's gonna be help him a lot without Cydia jailbreak is not gonna be alive and as I told you guys we waiting right now to update Cydia once that done once we see Cydia has been updated we will see the jailbreak after that and I, as I told you guys no more information about uh, if the jailbreak will be released before Cydia or after Cydia has been updated so no more information about that once I have more information about, about that I will be making a short post in another video and then giving you guys information about that let me jump right now talking about Houdini from the last time I'm never talking about Houdini so uh, let me just talking about it right now for the people who don't know what's Houdini Houdini is uh, kind like a semi jailbreak that's going to be available or support the 64 bit devices on the iOS 10.3.1 up to iOS 10.3.2. The iOS 10.3.3 is not supported, but it might this is going to be updated in the near future to work even on the 10.3.3. And uh, most of the people they don't like it yet, that's because there is no uh, a lot of uh 
packages or tweaks on it but this is going to be updated in the near future as i heard and uh the abra masai which is going to be the developer for houdini who works on it and then also he's the same developer for saigon talking about the saigon jailbreak the last beta we see from Saigon, which is going to be the third beta, uh, the developer already, which is going to be the Abraham Masari. He add more support devices, and I already talking about that. As you guys can see here on the support devices section, he add a little bit more devices for that. And uh, talking about the iPhone 6, that's going to be supposed to be uh, support the iPhone 6 on the 10.3.x, which is, is not available yet. Once is that going to be available, and once we see another beta, what will be released in the public i will be making sure to post another video on talking about it in the near future okay so the next thing that i'm going to be talking with you guys about it which is going to be the thumb star Thumbstar already he took the uh, Seguza uh exploit which is going to be the same exploit working on the 64 bit devices on the 10.3.3 but then stars already he took that exploit and he works on it on the 32 bit devices and then he already uh tried to work on it and then as you guys can see right now on the picture he already demonstrated that cdi has been running on an iphone 5 and then he already set up a theme on his device and that's going to be approved from the star he already jolly break the 32 bit device device on your iPhone 5 and it also is going to be supported in iPhone C in the near future to work so uh, that's going to be on the 10.3.3 talking about the 10.3.1 10.3.2 and also up to 10.3.3 uh, we will be see uh, somebody else who work on that exploit because the exploit as I said from Sagusa it's already released and he talking about it here from a long time ago if I as you guys can see, should I stay on the 10.3.3 or update to iOS 11? That's because most of the people, they want to update their devices to iOS 11 to jailbreak their devices. Nobody want to stay on the iOS 10.3.1 up to iOS 10.3.3. That's because most of the people, they don't believe that uh, there is a jailbreak will be released in the near future. So uh, let's talk about Sagusa again here. And now what about if I should I stay or an update? So what about if I though on the iOS 10.3 ever uh, gonna be stay? So the exploit has been dropped flat from um, a long time ago and I already make a video talking about that. So if you are right now on the iOS 10.3.1 up to 10.3.3, uh, stay there. Here, stay on lower version you will be get a jailbreak as soon as we see somebody uh, already working about that and I already told you guys about the temp star here he already worked on the same exploit but in a 32 bit there is nobody right now work on the 64 bit but this is gonna be uh, happen in the near future Okay, so the last thing that I want to talk in with you guys about it, let me talk in about the uh, IJA00, which is he's already uh, talking he released on a uh, jailbreak on a public is going to be support the iOS 11 up to iOS 11.1.2. That's going to be for the 64 bit devices, including the iPhone X. Guys, totally, this is going to be a fake. And I already talking about that on Twitter. I'm never talking about it in a video. And I don't even want to waste your time talking about fake stuff. So guys, once again, I don't want to uh, waste your time talking about something fake. So stay away from that. Totally, it is fake. So this is the most information, most the stuff. As I told you guys, once I have more information, more stuff, talking about it in the near future about the covering the Jello break start from the 10.3.x uh, up to 11.x anything will be happen make sure to follow me on twitter once i have any kind of information will be in hands and also if there is anything will be happen i will be making sure to post another video as soon as possible to update you guys as i said if you don't subscribe make sure to subscribe and stay tuned in the channel so you will be notified you will be always on update about if everything will be happen in the near future that's it pretty much about this video and this is the most information that i have right now make sure to stay tuned in the channel once again and i will catch you guys with the next one peace